Oh boy, look what I got in the mail, everybody. From PS4 Testing Division Japan to 67 Neil in the USA. I wonder what it is. Let's open it up and find out. Okay, I've just unboxed uh, my package. I'm amazed at all this stuff. What's in this little box? I'm glad I don't have to send this back. They're letting me keep the system. Um, this is freaking awesome. I went through the packing list here. I'm going to tell you everything. This is all the, all the stuff I got. I got a letter from... I don't know. It's, it's... I think it's Japanese. I can't really read it. I'm going to have to have my girlfriend translate it. She speaks Spanish. So she might be able to figure it out. But I got this. This is the... Interactive Biker Demo PS4 More or Less. Less is More. Instruction Manual. Wireless Gloves. Don't be fooled by imitations. Wireless Jacket. Whoa. And the helmet. This is awesome. HD Visor. You click that down, and it's like you're integrated into the system. Um, I read the instructions, and um, this is this is it right here. This is the whole thing. Um, I heard about this system on More Death 13's station, and I just and then they sent me this, and it's like, oh, this is so cool. But I really suggest from the instructions I read that you use a surge protector it's for your protection because. Um, the human integration computer system that you got to plug into, well, they have this lube, and it's called Interactives, Cyber Interactives. So, um, due to the graphic content of plugging in, I can't show it on YouTube, but it involves this plug insertion in an orifice, and you have to use the lube. So, when you plug in, I really suggest a surge protector. Just, uh, just because, I don't know. Lightning storms, whatever. Um, God, I'm just so excited about this. You just wouldn't believe. I can't wait to try it out. I'm going to gear up. I'm going to put on all this interactive stuff, and we can, you know, oh, this is really cool. You're saying, it's like, well, how does this play? How do you get this disc to play? In the pocket of the jacket is the drive. You just slide that baby in, and you're ready to go. Oh, I can't wait. Um, we'll do part two of uh, just testing out the system. Oh, what's also really cool is there's a mic in here. There's a V-log mode. <laughs> it doesn't get any better than this. There's fans, uh, speakers. The fans are for uh, so that you feel like you're getting wind, and it will create a whistling sound inside the helmet. It's totally crazy, but there's speakers in there too. Surround sound, 3D HD. I mean, these guys at PS4 think of everything. Okay, um, here is the uh, demo of the game, but. They even modeled my scooter. I mean, this is incredible. Um, it has a key down here. It's really hard to figure out. I keep missing everything. I don't understand. Oh, wait a minute. I remember reading the instruction in the instruction manual that um, sometimes I'm going to check the cable. Oh, there it is. It kind of slipped out. I'm glad I'm not really sitting on anything. But you have the key, and you start her up. Just like, oh yeah, you got a kill switch too. That's pretty crazy. Now here we go. Okay, it's in a warm up phase. But we can check out some of the features. You have a light switch, high low beam. Um, you have a horn. Yeah, you have blinkers. Wow, they even sound realistic. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Um, you have a kill switch. Um, hazard lights. That's pretty crazy. And you grip the throttle. 
You can give it gas. And you have brakes. It's pretty simple. We're in a warm up phase. We're gonna take this out. Uh, the, the game demo is a training demo and it's called like My Neighborhood. So I guess we're gonna. It has like other game modes like Biker Wave and it's like playing collect points by trying to get like, you know, different people to wave at you. You start off with a noob wave, it's like this. But you gotta be really fast. Then you can get a low five. Then you can get even the more death 13 Hello Kitty wave. Um, if you try the waves while you're moving and if you haven't earned them, you crash. Because a lot of them involve like combinations where your hands are off the steering wheel and stuff. I mean off the handle part of the steering wheel, what an idiot. But anyway, um, we're going to try this game, we're going to take it for a spin and uh, see how it plays. It seems pretty realistic though. Whoa, whoa, easy. Brakes. Oh. Okay, just gotta get used to the integration. Okay. So it's just playing, it's like you get, the, you know, points for like, you know, using your blinkers and uh, there's like different uh, modes of gameplay where you could be like, you know, pedestrians. You gotta watch out for if they cross in front of you. Uh, squirrel mode. Um, what else? Oh, uh, so you can psycho gauger mode where all the, you know, cars are trying to kill you. Um, suicidal pedestrian mode. It's pretty crazy. I, I think everything's on, since this is like a training thing, every, everything is on, uh, but like you can go to the, the PS4 store, you can buy add-ons, you can buy equipment, uh, like a GPS, so you have like a mapping system. Um, you can create your own uh, maps, the global maps, you can, you can buy in Taiwan, USA, anywhere, Korea, England, Scotland, Ireland, wherever you want to go, Africa, Antarctica, anywhere, it's global, this is pretty sweet, this is a pretty neat demo, this is very realistic, I mean, it's like I can even feel the wind, and uh, the physics of this game is just incredible, because it's like, I really feel like I'm riding a bike. It's totally crazy. Oh, but this is it. This is as far as the map goes. And it would... And you just pull into your garage. Incredible game. Incredible. I give this, like, five stars. At least. <laughs>